Um, this is an ebook reader, but because it's got Android, it's got additional capabilities other than ebook. So it doesn't have a touch screen. You always want to go straight to the icons, but what we do have here is a handy. Um, navigation device so you can move around there you can click it in to get to get there um, go back there's a home screen button so it's very quick very easy if you ever find that you've stopped using the device and you want to turn it back on uh, there's just an, an unlock switch so there's nothing's ever an accident with this product uh, it's got a nice library feature on there as well so everything is let me go let me go back so is that e-ink? It's not e-ink, no. Okay. It's, uh, it's just TFT. Um, but yeah, look, you've got sort of nice, nice icons to display the library of books. Um, you've got even more on the, on the actual bookshelf itself. So you go in here, if you had 101 books, it would display your 101 books. We've got five in this instance. So you just click on a book, and away you go. So go forward in pages, just like that. It will rotate as well. Come on. It definitely rotates. There we go. Okay. Right. Jump, back, jump back to the home screen. That's, that's the ebook reader. I mean, you can just, the more you carry on, the more you read the book, basically. Um, what this also has is additional capabilities. It's a Wi Fi enabled product. So you have uh, a browser on it. So there you go. That will, that will also uh, rotate as well, so it's all auto rotate, can be turned on and off at your, at your will. Uh, let's go home again. So that's ebook browser, it has email. So we've basically set up this, this home screen to be exactly why you'd want to use this product. You've got your bookstore, you've got your ebooks, you've got your browser, you've got your emails as well. Uh, you want to view any pictures, you've got your images. All in here. For this, in this instance, we're not using a, an SD card, but you could use an SD card. This is a two gigabyte internal memory, so you can store a lot of images, MP3s, video files as well. Which brings me on to the video player. So, like the other one, you like. I think you like this one as well. And I try not to speak too fast. I've got information rather than Okay. So you've got a built-in built -in speaker around the back as well, so you can, you know, easy touch volume control as well. Okay. So that's the video, video capability on there as well. Is there an app store? There is, uh, basically you get Gigastore, Gigastore, which is a, a small, a sm smaller scale version of the Android App Store. It's designed for, for products that don't use, say, Android 2.2 or above, mm -hmm. because you run into complications sure. if you sure. have a complicated app and it demands a feature like GPS or Bluetooth and your product doesn't actually have it. So what this will do is, this will give you apps that are definitely 100% usable on this product. So there's never a case of getting something that won't support your... Um, your device basically cool. okay you've also got as well we, we like we like this feature because of the uh, the Wi-Fi um, is our uh, tune in internet radio app on there so hundreds of local radio stations caters for all tastes plays out through the speakers also include a headphone connection as well so you can do that too transferring data is very easy through the uh, USB port charging port SD card and it also comes out of this case. So if you don't want to use it with the case, it's tough to get out so you can't drop it by accident. But you like using it, but oh no, it won't stand up anymore. It's actually got a built-in stand as well, so, so it will. There you go.